afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for taking time out of your busy afternoon in order to listen to us talk about Gold Spot Discoveries. My name is Sarah Sun, and I am Chief Data Strategist here at Gold Spot Discoveries. Over the next 10 minutes, you're going to hear me tell you why you, we are the most interesting company in attendance here today. Gold Spot Discoveries is the first company that is operating in artificial intelligence in the mineral exploration state base. We are a three-year-old startup, and we are about on the verge of an IPO at a current valuation of $37 million. Let's talk about innovation for a minute. There's a lot of chatter about innovations in the mining sector. Let's think 20 years from now. Or even better, let's think about 10 years from today. 10 years from now, the idea of using innovations and mineral, uh, sorry, innovations and machine learning in mining is going to be an absolute known truth. If you believe in that story, then you absolutely need to have companies today that are beginning to use artificial intelligence in order to transform that industry. Mining at its core is a big data problem. Let's think about over 100 years worth of data that is being used for mineral exploration today. I'm talking about satellite data, talking about paper maps that are sitting in boxes in some of our clients' offices, geochemistry data, metallurgical data, uh, geophysics, you name it. This is the type of data that is being used for mineral exploration today. So, however, that is a lot of data. It is an extremely complex problem. And it is completely begin to outstrip our abilities to process that by ourselves. However, this is actually our specialty. We are able to take all of that data, we process it and transform it with our proprietary technology, stitch it together, and we are actually able to solve these complex data problems today. We need a brand new way to transform the mining industry. Innovation is alive and well in the mining sphere, and Gold Spot Discoveries is how you begin to play that field. Our experiences over the last three years have proven to us that we are the leader when it comes to artificial intelligence in the mineral exploration space. Not only are we the first company to have done so, but we have done multiple contracts over the last three years that have proven that we, we actually know what we're doing. In addition to that, we have made so many active investments in order to make sure that we stay the leader in this space going forward. Uh, those additional investments also mean that we are creating new projects, new joint ventures, new NSRs, and we are also beginning to build a brand new royalty portfolio as well. Our technology has been validated with some of the biggest names in the industry. And so every single one of our clients have started with some sort of a proof of concept with us, and they've all turned around and invested real money into our company today. In addition, the, our services side has actually allowed us to build a new product called Resource Quantumental that I'm going to touch on. Resource Quantumental is what is actually opening up the space and the opportunities for us to actually build a brand new royalty portfolio, which is another reason why our investors are interested in us from the very, from the, for the long term. At the very core, our biggest asset is absolutely our team. We bring together a, more than 20 people of cross-functional skill sets. So I'm talking about earth scientists with PhDs in geology and geophysics, uh, as well as real data science skill sets, everything from, from physics, computational chemistry, and my own personal background is in statistics and mathematical finance. How does it work? So, a typical contract with one of our clients today begins with a land package. That land package and whatever resource that they're interested in, they turn over every ounce of data that they have for a specific property. Over the course of four to eight months, depending on the size and the amount of data that they have given us, at the very end, we actually take all that data, we stitch it together, we transform it in a way that our algorithms and our technology is able to process. At the very end of that, co that contract, what we do then is we actually turn over targets for mineral exploration. We actually will turn over a 3D map to our clients that say, we believe that your resource, you have exactly this much of it, it's going to have this shape, and it is this far underground. It is an incredibly powerful technology that we're working with today. Like I mentioned before, our clients have been very, very happy with the work that we have done. 
not only are all, not only are these names investors in our company, but they have all turned, gone on to do multiple contracts with us. I believe I believe one of these companies were actually doing our fifth contract, and we've become so popular in this space that we are currently booking work for the end of 2020. In addition, we are actually doing, we are finishing our current private placement and some of those investors have believed so much in what we do that they've actually turned around and they've invested more money into the businesses that we, into our business. They believe, they see the value of everything that we can do today and they are extremely excited about the long-term potential that we are bringing and our ability to transform this industry. Resource Quantumental. This is a personal favorite of mine. This is the product that I lead. Over the last three years, we have proven that we can do the mineral exploration. So now the question is, is there a way that we can actually use the expertise that we developed in that field and bring it together with all of the financial data sets out there and quite frankly, any data set that I can get my hands on in order to give us an edge in the financial markets. As a result, over, we have spent more than two years collecting data. It is the world's largest database that is combining mineral, mining data, geological data, as well as all the financials and some very interesting company-specific and insider data that we can use today. We are actively exploring and actively adding to this data set as well, and, and we are doing some very interesting things with it. Once we've put together this data set, what we are actually doing is we are trying to identify what makes a junior miner successful in the long run. So like I mentioned, we are, we are using our data set and our data skills to identify successful junior miners in the long term. Once we have identified a junior miner, we actually approach that junior miner and then we, we offer to partner. A typical partnership for us means that we will take an equity stake in them, they will exclusively use our services for mineral exploration, and then we will get a royalty of anything that comes out of the ground. This is allowing us to pursue more joint ventures and build, currently building our, our royalty portfolio. Like I mentioned, this is, this is very exciting times for us. We have been extremely successful over the last three years and we are going to IPO at the end of next week. So if you're interested in following us on the public markets, you will find us on the TSX Ventures under the ticker spot. Once we IPO, the, re the resource quantumental side of things is going to allow us to, to pursue some very interesting contracts in both the short and the long term. The in interest that we have in resource quantumental from our investors is absolutely incredible. They, are, they fundamentally believe that this is going to be the future of our company and this is a brand new way to play the mining space. To summarize, Goldspot Discoveries. We are a technology company. We happen to work in the mining sphere. We bring innovation to a field that is sorely lacking, and we are, we are the beginning of transforming this industry today. Any questions? You're IPOing next week, and you said 37 million valuation. What's the uh, expected share price, and what did the insiders get in at? So the, um, at the end of, so current private placement, it closing, closing on Friday, uh, the current financing round, we have currently raised, uh, it's 7.5 and we are actually oversubscribed, which is fantastic. Uh, the valuation before the, that, pri that financing was, is, is roughly 27, 29 million dollars. We are going to IPO, that share price is gonna be 40 cents when we IPO. If any of you have any questions in the future, we have an interesting cross-section of both founders, uh, our earth scientists, data scientists, as well as uh, it's just some interesting people that are very that we can provide any information you have across all of our projects as well as our future projects. Uh, if you want any information on that private placement, like I said, our last day is uh, we have a hard date of Friday, this Friday, and so you need to be able to. We can send you all the prospectus and all the information and our financials of that is something that you are interested in. Otherwise, just come by for a chat. Thanks so much, everybody.